The Muslims in the West African nation are set to change the narrative of negative impressions of Islam that has dominated media content all over the world. They say it is time to ask whether the people are being managed, manipulated, massaged or brainwashed by the media. New Central's Ni Omoni tells us more. Technology suggests that the society as a whole is now a simple hostage of the hands of the media, which means the media in the wrong hands can be weaponized to change, create and replace perceptions about personalities and situations. To curb anti-Muslim bias and bigotry, Muslims in Nigeria are ready to examine how the media frames Islam-related events in news reporting. It will cost the Muslims the truth about Islam, the truth, that's the cost, because wrong information will be wrapped in propaganda. These are one of the issues that are causing disunity in our country, and in respect of our religion or tribe, we must try to promote goodness. We must always try to speak the truth. Anything that we know is not true, we should completely avoid it. So anybody who says anything wrong, we believe it should be brought to justice. The legal system is competent enough to be able to adjudicate on such issues. Upholding the ethics of reportage and wearing the ideal personality of Islam has been identified as key to curbing fake news and promoting justice and fairness. Things that are, you know, uh, that are right can be seen as wrong if they are presented that way by the media. That's why media practitioners have a duty to their lords to know that they will be accountable you know, before their lords and know that whatever we want to achieve by uh, misrepresenting some ideologies is bound to fail. Because telling the truth is very important in ensuring that we have peace in our society. If we are spreading fake news, cause rancor, cause crisis, and that should not be what should be at this stage when we can easily fast check our stories and let people know the truth. That will bring about that level of consciousness in people that it does not suffice for you to just um, get a news item and just think that is all uh, what it is. Emphasis has been made on the collective effort of journalists editors and corporate ownership of the newspaper and mainstream media to suppress the negative media portrayal of Islam. Ni Omani, reporting for New Central.